Hey everyone, thank you for tuning in to week 13 of my 25 game FBS college football journey. So today I'm going to tell you about the Western Carolina at Alabama game. My friend Rusty was coming in for the game. He went to Western Carolina. So he was supposed to fly into Nashville around 530 on Thursday, but had a tough time with the flight. There was delays. Um, four different times they delayed and he ended up having to come back the next day. Uh, they told him around 11.30 p.m. That, that Thursday night. So he ended up flying same time on Friday, moved it a full day, uh, but that was all right. We were pumped up to go to the game. So I picked Rusty up from the airport around like 5.45-ish, 6, somewhere around there. Drove three and a half hours to Tuscaloosa. We got there around 10.30, no stops. So we ended up eating at Arby's and stay with the family friend. We woke up around 6 a.m. that morning, very early for the 11 o'clock game. It had been raining all night and it continued to rain up probably until about 7 a.m. So her and her boyfriend prepared a phenomenal breakfast for us. Eggs, bacon, uh, toast, it was phenomenal. So finally around 8 a.m. it stopped raining. They dropped us off by the stadium and we walked around. It was still raining a little bit, but not too much. Uh, it was definitely, it was a cold, damp day. So with an 11 a.m. kickoff, uh, there wasn't quite the tailgating scene that I was kind of hoping for, but you know, it was still a lot of anticipation, a lot of excitement for the game. And the walk, we went, ended up going to the walkthrough, um, which started at 9 a.m. And that was really cool. So. We walked around, um, and Rusty, he couldn't believe how nice the frats and sororities were at Bama. They all look like mansions, uh, and I mean, they are really well-maintained over there. So we went to, like, Denny Chimes, saw the band playing. Uh, then at that time, you know, it was probably about an hour before the game, we went into the stadium Walked up the ramp, you know, to the upper deck. Uh, my friend John had given us two free tickets from his uh, season ticket package for the Western Bama game. So that was really nice of him. And uh, so we ended up going to Dreamland Barbecue concession stand once we were in, in the game. Phenomenal. Uh, those barbecue nachos are really good. So definitely uh, would highly recommend those barbecue nachos so anyway we watched the warm-ups then the game started and uh western they looked good for one drive uh they didn't didn't really result uh in too many points but uh they played fairly well the first quarter bama ended up winning by a large margin though western managed to get a field goal but you know the game ended up um uh, you know going fairly well uh you know, Bama played well, and it's a good, crisp, you know, clean game. So uh, we ended up going to Ramajamas for a little bit after, and and then we ended up going to uh, the Strip, uh, where, like, Hound's Tooth is and Gillette's. So Rusty wanted to try this famous yellow hammer drink, and we ended up eating after that. We ended up eating at Buffalo Phil's near the Strip. I got a hamburger. We, so we were watching the Georgia-Texas A&M game. Everyone in there was rooting for Texas A&M to help Bama out. We were trying to get in the playoffs, uh, especially since Bama had already beat Texas A&M and Georgia was competing for the fourth playoff spot. Uh, both of them didn't end up getting in the playoffs. But um, So after we took an Uber back to the house, uh, Rusty and I finished packing our bags. We ended up leaving for Nashville um, that night. So we stopped at Petco gas station. So this is one of the cooler gas stations. I, it was somewhere in Alabama. Um, it had a full arcade, bunch of light up signs. So it had like an iron skillet, three other restaurants. I mean, it was like a, you know, mini convenience center with, you know, tons of restaurants in there. We you know we got gas, um, got, you know, some snacks and drinks or whatnot um some bunch of water so anyway uh got back to nashville got back around 11 15 and 
you know, it was, it was a fun trip. So ended up, you know, watching college football the rest of the night. Thank you for tuning in. There's a the ticket stub. And there's the program.